Hey, what's going on Tackle Warehouse fans? Jake here bringing you this week's episode of What's New Tackle Warehouse. Got a bunch of great products and a few new companies for you as well. First one we're gonna go into is a few products we got from Azuma. This first one right here is the Z-Dog Topwater Walker. Um, this is an awesome topwater bait. I believe it's about four and a half inches in length. Um, it's got a unique design on it. It's got a flat bottom and it also has a slight concave mouth on there. So, I mean, it walks with these. It takes little effort to get it to walk side to side. And that little cup on there splashes a little bit of water, get a nice, nice commotion out of it. Also got a pretty loud internal rattling system in there. So create a lot of disturbance, it actually gets a lot of big bites. And got some razor sharp hooks on there. Next one from Azuma is a, a new lipless crankbait. This is the Shaker Z lipless crankbait. This is an awesome lipless crankbait. It has a really wide flat head on it, so you get a bunch of vibration. And what I noticed about it, it's got a really wide belly on it as well. So if you guys like to yo-yo your lipless crankbaits, this one gets a, an awesome fluttering action on the fall. So, uh, you know, springtime of the year. I know you guys up north, you know, lakes are starting to unice a little bit. Lipless crankbait's gonna be on. Try out the new Shaker Z. All right, next up from Azuma, the ones I'm most excited about are the new Z-Boss series of crankbaits. Now we have these everywhere from a 10 foot all the way up to a 25 foot diving crankbait. Um, what's cool about these crankbaits, you know, different than any other crankbait is their super thin lip design and then also the, the head design on here. Uh, as you can see, it's really slanted. So it, it's actually built like a sports car. So it doesn't have a lot of drag to it. So um, it's really easy to crank down. It dives really quick. It doesn't pull like a lot of those 20, 25 foot diving crankbaits out there. Also inside of it, the weight transfer system, I mean, it feels like there's a cannonball inside there. So, I mean, you can cast this thing a mile. And, you know, it's important when you're deep cranking out there, as long as cast you get, you know, the deeper you're gonna get these things. They come in some awesome colors and they all got razor sharp hooks, premium split rings on it. This one right here is the Z-Boss 20. This is actually the same crankbait that Tim Horton used uh, for setting the all time catch record on, on Major League Fishing. So, if you guys are looking for that crankbait, we got it now. All right, next up from Jack Bates. We got a bunch of stuff from Jack Bates. I just wanted to get, highlight a couple for you guys. This first one is the new Jackhammer Skippin' Buzzbait. As you can see, a pretty unique design, specifically designed to, to feature a, a soft plastic frog or a creature bait, something of that nature. Um, a lot of guys are getting into that versus throwing traditional skirts. So it comes pre-rigged, ready with a VMC screw lock um, hook on there that's already, you know, with the belly weight on there. Make sure, you know, your bait planes and rides level every time. And also you see that unique hinge design, so your you know, fish aren't gonna get that much leverage on it. So you'll be able to, um, to fight fish a little easier and not lose as many. Also the way this is set up, you're gonna be able to skip your baits a lot farther underneath docks, overhanging limbs, anything like that, where you can't really get a traditional buzz bait in there as well. So check that one out by Jack Bates. Next we got a couple awesome jigs from them. This first one is their dock rock skipping jig. So you can see really flat arky style head on here. And it comes with a with a hand tied skirt and uh, I believe it's a 2x must add flipping hook on there. Super stout hook. They got some awesome colors. It's a great all around jig. All right, next up, this was designed by Keith Pochet. So this is the KP Power Finesse Jig. Super compact jig. What I like about the head design, it's got two flat sides on it. One flat side perfectly in line, so you get you know great skipping action out of it, and then another flat side right below the line tie. So. It actually stands up really well with the trailer, almost almost like a shaky head. So you get you know great action out of it. Real thin cut finesse skirt on there. But it's great, you know, it's, it's a finesse jig, but it also has that a 2X power flipping hook on there. So it's compact, but still has a lot of strength. So you don't have to worry about, you know, using 15, 20 pound line when you still want to, you can downsize your profile, but still use heavy duty tackle, get fish out of heavy cover with a small, small bait. Check that one out from Jack Bates. Next up, we got Jack Bates Tungsten Peg Stops. Now, I wanted to show you guys these because these come in a 60 pack. I believe they come, they're 279 and you get 10 rings uh, with six peg stops on there. So incredible value, you know, no longer, you know, 10, 12 pack, you can buy 60 peg stops at one time with these. Make sure to check out all the other stuff from Jack Bates as well. All right, next up from Owner, all you Ned Riggers out there, we got the new Owner Blockhead. So the Ned Rigging has been, you know, taken off like crazy the last few years. Owner is giving you that mushroom style head, but with a premium owner hook on there, wire keeper, so holds the bait on there really well. So just really great Ned Rig head for all you guys that like to do that technique. All right, next up from Greenfish, this is the Casey Ashley Cleanup Shaky Head. So awesome, well-built shaky head, has a flat bottom on it, but it has a slight concave uh, groove cut into the middle of the head there. So 
kind of gives it a little bit of shoulders, so it prevents it from rolling over side to side. So, you know, it keeps your bait standing up when you want it to down there. So you're not going to have any problems with the bait falling on its side, uh, you know, and, and messing up your shaky head presentation. Also comes with a, a light wire owner hook on there, premium hook. You know, you can use six, eight pound test, you know, on light action spinning rod. You're going to have no problem getting plenty of hook penetration with this shaky head. So check that out by Greenfish. All right, next up from Ishikawa, we got two new hooks from them. So right here is the TS3 drop shot and flipping hook, and this is the TSW hook. So this TSW hook, a smooth shank design, it also has a gray, uh, kind of a silk, silky coat finish on there. So really slick coating, you get awesome hook penetration. This one's specifically made for Nico rigging and, uh, and wacky rigging. And what I like about these, the eyes offset just slightly, so you get a little, it's not perfectly in line with the eye, so you get a really good hookup ratio with this for, you know, wacky and Nico rigging. Same thing with this TS3 flipping hook. Uh, so it's made, they have it in some smaller sizes, which makes it a phenomenal drop shot hook as well if you're trying to drop shot through heavier cover like grass and things like that. Um, the, the points offset as well, so you get great hookup, hookup ratio on it. It's got that, you know, that gray finish on it as well, super slick, great hook penetration. And then this one, it's got a, a hand-wrapped wire bait keeper on there. So it's gonna, you can bend it out and make it a little bit, you know, stand out a little bit more if you want, but it's gonna hold your soft plastics on there really well. So if you like to drop shot around heavy cover or just looking for a new flipping hook that you know, you're gonna get a little bit better hookup ratio with, try these out from Ishikawa. All right, last two we got here. This one right here uh, from PH Customs. This is the FUD crankbait. This is actually, co-designed with uh, PH Customs and Elite Series Pro Matt Heron. This is going to be great for any time you're dealing with uh, cold water situations or any type of high pressure. If, you're, if your lakes receive a lot of pressure, it's definitely one you want to give a look into. So premium, balsa, you know, handmade balsa wood construction crankbait like all the, the PH Customs bait. So you see this one, super thin body, flat sided construction with a rounded circuit board style lip on there. So this gets a a really good tight wiggling action, really subtle. So like I said, great for any of those times where you know it's really cold, the fish are lethargic, or there's just a lot of pressure on your lake. Um, just like all the other PH Customs baits, you know, premium hooks on there, premium split rings. So you take this right out of the package and you can go you know, right to fishing with it. No need to change hooks or nothing like that with it. All right, and last up, my favorite from True Bass. This is the new True Bass Minner uh, hollow body swim bait. As you can see, three and a half inches in size, tiny little hollow body swim bait, but it's actually symmetrically the same as, as their other, uh, the perfect head and, um, and the little head hollow body swim bait. So if you guys never fished a true, ba fished a true bass hollow body swim bait, they're phenomenal hollow bodies. Um, they have a little bit more rounded bait fish profile to them, so you get less of that side to side uh, body roll like you do with most hollow body swim baits, and you actually get a little bit wider, a little bit harder thumping tail action with it. So this is gonna be perfect for any of those times of the year where you have that really small bait fish, usually you know, sometimes in the middle of summer or in the fall, uh, sometimes out here in, in California, you know, in May we have like you know, little half inch sized thread fins running around. This is gonna be great for any of those times of the year where you're dealing with something like that. Uh, you can fish this on a ball head, you know, uh, a darter head. Uh, you can drop shot this thing, but you know, you can, and it's even, you can even throw it on a on an umbrella rig when you're trying to mimic those really small schools of, uh, of bait fish. So they got in a bunch of awesome colors. Make sure you check this one out by True Bass Swim Baits. Thanks for tuning in, and for more information on the product seen here today, make sure to click shop or the link in the description below. And if you enjoyed this week's video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and make sure to put a comment in the section below to let us know which one of these products you're most excited about.